Cars are a major form of pollution, responsible for nearly a quarter of all global carbon dioxide emissions. But they are also an indispensable part of modern life. Making cars cleaner is a vital step towards cutting dangerous greenhouse gases and other pollutants. Sean Cook and his team at UNSW School of Mechanical and Manufacturing Engineering are developing cleaner engines by starting at the burning heart of the matter. When engineers in car company develop a new kind of engine, this is what typically do is bring that prototype engine and set it up with a device called dynamometer, which can simulate all those actual operating conditions. And you measure emissions level and efficiency. But then problem is that all the information that they get doesn't explain the whole story of combustion that's happening in an engine. What we need here is visual information of combustion process that's really happening within the cylinder. So here is an optically accessible diesel engine that's built for the first time here in Australia. And this can give us some visual information about the emissions formation and also efficiency that's really happening within the combustion chamber. This is the typical piston that you can find from a diesel engine. And to get an optical access into the combustion chamber, which has high pressure and a high temperature, harsh environment in it, we develop a window that's made out of wood, which is high strength glass, and replace the metal portion of the piston using this glass. And this is the optically accessible piston that we just developed and this one can give you a access into the optical or visual access and optical access into the combustion chamber like you through this um, quartz piece. So using the piston quartz and reflex meter there, we take images of combustion chamber, the fuel that's burning within the chamber using a high speed camera which gives us a visual information of event occurs at a very high speed. This is the high speed movie that we have taken using the optically accessible engine and also a high speed camera. And in the background, you can see again four valves and fuel injector right at the center. And the brightness that you can see from this movie is from burning fuel. And we can use this image information to understand the emissions formation. Now, for example, right at the center, you can see the brightness persists for a longer time than it should be and that can be a potential cause for high soot emissions in a diesel engine. And by understanding this behavior, now we can give an answer how to eliminate that soot particles forming within the engine. And that's the value of high speed movie and the value of optical engine. So, so far we have been working on this optically accessible diesel engine and we are planning to develop a new optically accessible engine based on spark ignition direct injection engine which is known as SIDI engine. And our main focus on the new optical engine will be uh, ethanol fuel usage. And we're going to study about how ethanol burns in an optically accessible SIDI engine to further improve the efficiency and also to use renewable fuel in an SRDI engine. So every year, 60 million cars are sold. And it will be pretty tough job to have electric vehicle or hybrid engine that can answer all those customers' demands. And so I strongly believe that combustion engine will still take majority of the market even in the long-term future. So our job using this new tool is to improve the efficiency and reduce the emissions.